I am sure sports. You know me there, yeah? I'm coast to coast representing. I'm going to say this is right as representing for Omar. You don't know, come get the sports over here from near and far. Oh, boy, boy, boy. Me say, I am sure sports, one thing me sure about When me say sure, that mean me not doubt Come get your sports, get it over air Come subscribe, repost and share I am sure sports, one thing me sure about When me say sure, that mean me not doubt Come get your sports, get it over air Come subscribe, repost and share, yeah, share. If me not sure, that mean me not say it Know who score, that mean me not say it Never know no game play, that mean me not say it If me never seen a game, me not know who play For your sports news, better come over your son For your soccer news, then come over your son If you don't love sports, still come over your for the day, don't you want to love over your son? So, so, when it comes on to behavior concerning football, Jamaica is, is decent. I am sure that if we can get all of these things done, set in place by the end of April, it gives us enough time before the World Cup campaign. Not afraid of no Brazil, no Argentina with these crap of players. We are good enough. Remember to like, subscribe, 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 share. Listen, comment, let me know what your thoughts are. Made up of 18 Jamaican herbs and spices. Add delicious, bold flavor to your next grilling experience. Flavoring sauce, a marinade, basting, condiment, or topping. Trick Nick Jerk Barbecue Sauce. Trick Nick Jerk Marinade gives your meats and vegetables authentic Jamaican jerk flavor. The spices are directly from Jamaica. Spices like jerk seasoning, allspice, scotch bonnet pepper, fresh scallions, thyme, ginger, and garlic. The key ingredients to a great jerk marinade. 0% sugar and low in sodium. You want to try it? All right, good morning, good morning, good morning, every single one of you out there. Welcome to I Am Sure Sports. I'm your host, Manin is Man. And today we have a dynamic, I'm telling you, informative interview lined up for you. It's going to have all the characteristics of what you call an excellent interview. So get ready, get your water bottle beside you. Make sure you're sitting down, you're comfortable. If you're at work, put in those pods, your headpieces, earphones, whatever it is, so you can listen, even though you may not be able to watch. It's going to be good. I promise you that. But first and foremost, you know, we have to always begin by looking to the hills from whence come it or help. Our help comes from the Lord who made heaven and earth. Want you to remember that. He that keeps you, he never slumbers and he never sleeps, meaning he never gets weary. And as his eyes are on the sparrow, so he watches over you. Big thank you to our sponsors, the sponsors of this video. Yes, they are Prestige Finance, lending a helping hand when you need it most and if you need up to a hundred thousand jamaican dollars to borrow you can just call prestige finance let them know that you heard about them from i am sure sports and here's what will happen you will get same day processing no processing fee and zero to four percent interest rate they are located in linstead st catherine jamaica also want to big up launch legacy where they handle risk and seek legacy for all your personal insurance needs in canada and the usa visit them at launchlegacy.com or call or text 647-989-0782 you know patrick reed he will be there Yes, he will be there to help you. Just call Launch Legacy. You will see their number running in the banner section on the channel for portions of this video. Also want to big up Trick Nick, the Jamaican-owned and operated company. 
in Canada. They use authentic Jamaican herbs and spices to make all their products. So please ensure that you visit them at Trick Nick Shop and buy some Jamaican good jerk marinade, barbecue sauce, hot pepper sauce, curry paste, all of those fantastic things. They are also now available on the Jamaican market. IT push. We need to connect because your package will be made and sent to you direct. All right. So, yes, people, to all the persons in the comment section, want to thank you so, so, so much for coming and being a part of this. Please remember, once you come on, we ask you, it takes a quick second to like the video. That's how you support the channel. You can like the video, share the content, subscribe if you have not yet subscribed or get someone to subscribe. Also, here's what I want you to do, right? We have super chat and super sticker. If you have a question for our guest or a question for me, the best way to get it up is to use a super sticker or a super chat and we get it up there for you so you can be seen and recognized. Without any further ado, I'm going to invite this morning to join me on the I am sure sports uh, virtual space. This is the first man from that school down in Meadowbrook Estate, the school of them say, be a money people got it. You understand me? The, the school that produced man like Trevor Lamb, Claude Davis. But we have none of those two today. We have the man them call him Craig. I know him as Jingo, but somehow he transformed from the Jingo to the Warlord. And now when we say Warlord, he's a man of peace. But when it comes on to the football field, <laughs> if you try to pass him, you may end up with pieces of you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, let's welcome. <laughs> yeah, come turn on the light for me. Yes, yeah, sir. White. Yo, Omar. Love, <laughs> love you. <laughs> love. <laughs> blessed love. Blessed love. Blessed yeah, love, man. Yeah, man. So good to have you. So good to have you this morning with us. Um, you're a lit. The, the yeah. area is a little dark. So once you get the light on, we should be good to go. Yeah, man. Okay. All right. There you go. That's so much better. Yeah. All right. I want the people to see the people. All right. I want you to watch this. He's going to smile for the entire interview. You know. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Remember, I tell you this. He's going to smile for the entire interview. All right. He can't, he can't stop. Right. So, watch it. He's going to try hard to stop because I point it out, you know. But he can't help himself. All right. So, just watch the interview. All right. <laughs> but, um, Let's start out, uh, Sir White. You understand me again? Welcome. Thank you so much for making yourself available. Really appreciate you. You're coming on. You know, once the call was made, the connection was made, you were just all in. I said, listen, anything, anytime, I'm ready to go. And I really appreciate that. also want to thank um, your wife for being able to, to just be there to support you so that you could do this. So tell her that we, we here say also a big thank you to her because, you know, she helped. Um, in her own way to facilitate this interview happening. All right. So thank you and thanks to her okay. as well. Okay. All right. Yeah. All right. So uh, the, the floor is yours. I, uh, I, the stage is yours. I want to begin by asking you to share with the persons who are out there watching now how it all started for you and just tell us about your days in football all the way up to your Meadowbrook High School days. And then we will move from there into yeah. your playing in the leagues. But go ahead and tell us from where it started how it started, how the journey was. Well, first, I'm going to point out, me look, me look out. you know what I'm saying? I watch the ESPN, the ESPN thing, and you have them at Gamma, you see who can be the finalist in the last speech, and the yeah. Ella always have him look board behind him with him thing, sign up with whatever he wants to say. Yeah. Big up my grandma, Enid McFarlane, you know? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. she know, she know the journey, you know? She, she's still a baton, so... As we live awesome. in Glendale Clothing Scheme, you know, we're big up for grandmother, you know. But he says I'm going to start it over Portsmouth. So I want Portmore for no say, yeah, part of football. And I mean, I always I have a gratitude for over that side of the town to all the journey they set as a light growing up. When mommy have to make the decision to go over there, go live. I'm going to start to scrimmage a play up on the road. You don't know the Jamaican thing already, you know. We start our love feed from there, you know, tender age. But to be more 
assuring my father what passed out when I was 10. I never get no time for have the father love there with no hug and no chew up in a ear as baby Sham would have said and them things. Never see my father. But what him do leave me with is him send me a football boat, which was a Nike. And I don't know nothing about loving it yet, you know. I'm going to lose the boats. And that kind of hurt me. And I'm sending back another boat in quick succession. I'm going to get a white boat, Omar, a white boat. So when I'm a little boy, you know, it's a white boat I'm playing, you know. And then now I go to Primacard Primary and start school school. Because guess what? 86 go venture. And you know, say, I know I say, I did go married and I hear that. So as I go to Primacard school, so I just turn up back and run God of my yard for the watch football. Though, and everybody yeah. gone. Football. You see me? And then you now the journey does start in other school. Eh? Within that school at Primacard Primary, you know, it, 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 it gives great pleasure if you can mention Primacard Primary on a platform. You know, if everybody knows, say, yeah, I'm a joke thing when you come on to the Alma Mato and where you're learning from. So, so Mr. Morgan, you know, and all of the other teachers, them who play them role in our groom, you know, so, you know, but Mr. Morgan and other Gilbert here, they, they have fine ways. And the school, they have teams before, you know, Omar, but me never inclined in it at that time, you know. Yes. I feel me, I feel me exam of five grade, you know. And through the ball and I mean, I'm going to get back and repeat now. You don't have to go sixth grade them time, Beto. So right. we got sixth grade. You feel, you get a chance to go sixth grade. So we got sixth grade and we decide to watch, you know. And my last year at primary school, this, you know, something I have to do. Yeah, yeah. me not come out, so something I have to do. Me have to get my name in a some way, some all like Jimmy Cliff. Me most famous. And <laughs> it start from this up. Right on the dirt field of a Prembacard primary, and then you could have walked through to the high school at Prembacard secondary at the time. Yeah, man, it start there, so man. But Omar, I carry it to a different level because I couldn't think about nothing else more than football, boy. Yeah, man. So that journey they take me to now, a bunch of us from Prembacard primary the Anga Shamat Dermot, the Andrea McLean, the O'Neill Five, the Andrew Comrie. Big up a friend them from Prembacard. Uh, they might like we, you know, football, but the brighter one, them be dead. Eh? And the blessing of us, whereas the talent and people are scout, yeah, my friends, yeah. them get all into Meadowbrook High School, which is puzzling to me, you know, Omar, because I have to go back to Mr. Morgan and ask him, you know, oh, Mr. Morgan, tell me something. I pass me, pass my exam, or a, or, or, or a talent team. I met yeah. you know, and Craig White, man, I passed you, passed your exam. So that the kind of me, no one ever thinks me still. So I'm not So when I'm that up, say, all right, then cool. But the journey at Meadowbrook, I went into Meadowbrook High School with even better footballers by my side, leaving out of primary school. You know, you know what I mean? Better talent in every way. And uh, even that, that, that went to Meadowbrook with you? Yeah, man. Angus Shamat Dermot, man. Right. And, Andre McLean, or we used to call one left man when end up a lead Meadowbrook and God done known high school and you know yes. propel himself, you know, propel himself till him, you know, and all of them really. I just make kind of summer where you gotta put your mind to play football forever. You, know. you have a strong to do it. You know, yeah. so we get them chance to migrate and we get them chance to go do a better thing, do a better thing. But we're going to high school with some real, real better talent than me. You know, so much so. What about it on the road and we say, watch this youth? Because you don't know, we're there on the youth them now and we are trying to show them about, you know, have to be the most talented player. Just work hard and every day you got training, keep something from them and put it in a year little thing and see if your little thing not build up and who knows where it carry up. So I was one of those players that was not the favorite of any coach. You understand? I see all of my friends them get the better life, you know? Get the sponsors, the car key, the bugs, the things, and yeah, we just hold it and work hard. Uh, it was no fun at Meadowbrook High School, still in Omar. As me I tell you, said, the work hard part for overcome when I got you with David on. God rest him soul, our father, and him groom with the best way he could before him skip and go to Calabar. Which we know why him do that still now, you know, all purposes. But yeah. it was not smooth sailing. And being that me never did balance yes. myself. I say, watch another man, I'm going to be a scientist or I'm going to be an a, a, a industrial arts man or what. Me just focus on 
football. Yeah, you know, yeah, man, football, you know, like football, you know, like the food, you know. And your father, your, your father had passed by this time when you were at Meadowbrook. I'm not tell him, my father passed off from the day in about three grade at primary school. So I saw come down rule the things that is still, even though I'm never there land still, I'm there foreign, but yeah, we never grow with no father either. But we have, we be smart enough to surround ourselves around figures of, you know, better mentally. Yeah. Yeah, so when you went to Meadowbrook, yeah. All right. Mm-hmm. So when you went to Meadowbrook, David Hunt was a coach. Yeah, when I got up. Okay. When, when it, I got right. up in the ranks. At Pepsi level first, it wasn't him. You know, David Pepsi level. That was Douglish Henry. Mr. Douglish. I call him Dal. Okay. Yeah, that's thinking of the Kasafa thing. So them man they really take me from youth and know the talent. But when you go up in a high school now, you have a face now. Right. So you it's so you played you played now. Pepsi you played Pepsi and Cold some Meadowbrook. Yeah, everything. All right. So in the Pepsi team, who was in the Pepsi team? You remember? I mean, how well did you do in Pepsi? Or were you a regular starter? Cause you said they had it rough and things. So uh-huh. how did Pepsi and Cold? Yeah. Oh we go, oh go Pepsi man, oh go Pepsi man. Meadowbrook, what will I leave for go at Meadowbrook High School? You know? Meadowbrook High School history. You know? If you go to Kingston College, a nine. Yeah. You know, I play against judges at 13 and all these things. So when we go in, we really go in at a mindset and say, yo, what you know? I'm going to change these features. I don't know about, him, but, but, but my other teammate. But me didn't know my purpose I go to high school. Me didn't know that. I didn't know, I got change of face there. I think. So starting off at Pepsi, we not a problem. Like, you know, that was, that, that, that was the sweetest time because you come out of reading my high school, out of primary school and going to high school. The coach love you from primary school, so you are his. And the coach will recruit you from primary school to Pepsi, you know. You are his, you know. So we got you a different mentor. We we'll play every game. We did very well. So well that our first game was against Calabar High School up at Calabar. And in that game, we got 3-0. Them time them I use big, big brisket. Yeah, big brisket from our water. Deck, deck, them call him. Yo, oh, yeah, 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 man. I remember that crick. Chris, Chris Brissett, Deck Deck. Yeah, man. Yeah, and then you have, you, you, you have the twin them where start off a color bar, but eventually went to St. George's. Yeah, that twin where uh, um, the player win them 92 with Robbie Scott. I have some, some, some real good ballers. Them, they have some real good ballers. So we get a good three long. But progressing, you know, the school and the, the fans, they must see something different and when it come down to Meadowbrook Field or the bottom field now, yeah. the school bring all the whole decks, them come in and decks are beat and them see a new generation. And from there, so, you see, say, yo, you see, Alma Mata love. When you play for your Alma Mata, you know, yeah, you have to struggle in a car. You don't know the journey at high school. But, but it's the way I wear your color there. You see me, I wear, <laughs> you have yeah, the general color there. You know, so, <laughs> you know, I think you know, you know. But, yeah, yeah after Pepsi, Things they get real rough for me. Uh, yeah, after it, it's in a rich course now, you have mostly teachers. At that time, you didn't have teachers where I deal with the course team. Oh, uh, so it wasn't it your coach matter. from primary, it's not the coach from primary school who recruited you. It was a like a teacher at the school. All right. So yeah. whereas I had a coach at first farm, Pepsi level, you know, Pepsi are from 13, under 14. Yeah. Going into the under 16 level now, we had Two teachers, no matter of fact, all of the male teachers them was like coach. From Mr. Wright to Mr. Garden to Mr. Bailey. So it was that coach per se was picking that team. So they went ahead and picked boys that they thought in their minds were, yo, could I get a game? So, so I, a who, were, game? Were there, who are some of the ballers who were, who were yeah. played? Were there good ballers there who were played over you or just? Hear me, man. This is how the journey go. <laughs> All of my teammates, them when me leave Pembroke Primary with, go to high school, all of them are play calls over me. Whoa. The teachers, they, you know what I say? All went and watch another man. We are school class, we are going to match in a man. Bag pack in a man. Bag pack every game in a man. Can't get a game. Rough. Rough. No joke. No joke. Uh, and here, I'm going to play calls, Omar. Here eventually, I um, end up playing courts. In 1992, 
Because from a girl, I'm a girl, I'm see Trevor Lam and Roger Thomas, them and the twin, them and Gully, them and Shushu Brown, them Garfield Brown, them and because Yo, that, me team, that, Meadowbrook, that Meadowbrook team with Trevor and won Walker Cup, right? No, the right, Walker Cup winning final. team was in 88, was in 86. But oh, Trevor oh, oh. team, the most team where would have propelled Meadowbrook to some consistent semi-finals, some consistent yeah, yeah, yeah. rounds. You understand? So we need the incline say, why not a bunch there? <laughs> why not a bunch there? So you know, me start training with the Money Cup team. And for the whole 92 summer, in a man, I train and I train and I train and I train and I play some practice games and I learn, you know, and I learn and I learn and I learn and I learn. Omar, when I start them come back from foreign, I bench me left with Manning Cup to start. <laughs> the first game in the National Stadium versus Calabar High School, I bench me left on. I, 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 I bet you send me down back in you know, the Then they build up the thing they know where if you play a money cup, you, you can't, can't come play the the court, but they can't move again. But yeah, so you, you know you could have make a move. Whoa. Just a step down to at the course that year there. And yeah, my propel Meadowbrook with the likes of Angus and Matt Dermot and Jimmy Well Blair and some so, so some ball around me where they need to reach as far as they could have reached. But yeah, we never have that steam that they beat the KC team there in you know, the stadium. So we get a 7-1 in the stadium in our Coles Finals. But within itself was an accomplishment for each at a Coles Final. I play against a prominent, dominant school like Kingston. Family, you know? So the roughness side, Omar, before you cut, you know, said 1991, I became a captain by virtue of Marvali. Because my community, Glendale, Marvali, Prembukal, Kingston, yes. 20. So, you know, you had minor league and president cup. President cup would have been the lower division, right. minor league, right? And we had Mr. Duncan, Blinks Duncan, Dennis Duncan, the King Blinks. Him developed a team of youths in 1991 who run the table, run the president cup table, send fear, fear throughout the summer league. Yeah, who are some of the players on that team apart from you? <laughs> if I name out some people from the team that I'm big about. He developed a team. I name out my Glendale bunch first before I got the Marvel bunch. So with the likes of Dylan Gale, right? Um, Carnegie's. Carnegie's them was JC, Jamaica College Goers, right? So yeah. And Carnegie played in the JC team with Virtue and Pauli them. And his brother was a vivid supporter of them too, but he went to the school. Um, Robert Chen, Angash Amat Dermot, Curtis Elimaya, that a Russian. Oh, yeah. Oh, so, so, I, I, that would be Elimaya, smaller brother. Brother, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, That's Kevin, El, Ch Kevin Elimaya, smaller brother, El people. Yeah. Smart brother. Um, Andre McLean, as I tell you, and you had Barclays, brother. You had a Barclay, brother. You had Marvin Barclay. And Marlon Barkley. So our Barkley was Skiddy. Right? He went to I remember which high school in Digo, Norman Manley. While the other brother might be aware of because he'd be playing at the year where Charlie Smith ball of them ball off the whole of them heading another money cup here there. Yeah. Every up on the Ligo and the and the and the, and the red chops, the, the brown chops and every man got ball that year there. So yeah. they here there. But we run the table. And what was amazing about that team, you hear me tell you something, I know nobody. I just hard work. Because it ended up that I'm a captain my team, you know. Right? And Marvel Buck, Medieval in a quarter final, not a knockout quarter final. What's it? You mean your coach Waga hot? What around me in high school, you know, talk truth, you know, I tell you, you Omar. Know, but you know, yeah, but the technical director. So, yeah. you're a part. So, yeah, so. We team perform violently. Yes, yeah, so much we have Waga bite all the straw. Waga never sting when him take out the straw them out of the ground and chow and you're kind of nervous. <laughs> and yeah, them people yeah. want an extra time. You know, that time they were add on to go to penalty shootout. But that propelled me now to make him see me up on a level. So now when okay. me come back 91 year, you know, it's a cold year, you know. All of a sudden now, you know, 
I'm going to give me a game, Captain. See, the first game I'm going to play, Omar. The first game I'm going to play. So, me come back now and a captain, made a group team now, you know. After in, I could in, the man, game. In, the, in the Manning Cup in 1991. 91, yeah. I'm a first cold touch before the 92 when I come down. Here we're going through the old President Cup thing and the captain see and we lift the trophy. Yes. Men are broke now, see me now. So all teachers and coaches, all right, Craig White, captain that game. Yeah. Guess who we are playing? Wolmers High School. Young baby, young blocks, young lions. Yeah, Wolmers High School, another prominent school. Yeah. And here what here what the catch now are. Right. May I play left back for the whole summer? With Marvale as captain of Marvale, right? And here comes now this game for Meadowbrook High School. Wagaga tell me to play sweeper. Captain <laughs> the team, but sweep. No, Omar. <laughs> May you know, sir. And not every and everybody build for play sweeper position if you not practice that from start. Me, me never prepare for that. The answer? It was dismal. We team get three love down a bottom field. And watch this over. You know what God do to me? What God take away the man from me, man? First, so the first game you're playing, they made your captain. You, you play out of position. And then you lose the captaincy. In a one day. Whoa. And that turned Craig White in a... Uh, yeah. From this, so I don't know what transformed. Yeah, man, we just, we, just, we just start go hard, man. We just start go hard. So, my time, most of the time in a day, you days, man, like, yo, just train and knock here. Yeah, so man, at some, at some time, I made a broke my arm, I just, just not care. I just I say, yo, man, I just train hard and not care. I'm going to score right. some, made a bro. Yes, mm? so that, that, that was like your first full season in the Manning Cup at Meadowbrook, for Meadowbrook. Your first, where you play regularly. Courts. I'm not play Manning Cup till 93. 93. Whoa. First full year that now. All right. So tell us about that year. Uh, um, tell us about the Manning Cup years now. Uh, starting with 1993. Because it's two years you end up playing, right? 93 and 94. 93, 94, 95. Okay. Yeah. Tell us about those years and how did Meadowbrook do? Well... Uh, in 93, you get the term, you know, because you say, what's your name, man? Stars, them gone, you know. All of the legends, them at the school, gone. You understand? And you know, by playing and playing and playing and you no know, schoolboy football, but name start called more, new start make. Um, we start become a leader. Yeah, we never normally need the captain and band to lead, you know, but, you know, we lead, you know. But, David don't have a matter about him, whereas we used to recruit as well, you know. So a lot of normal manly, whereas they must take on their for them turn to high school. That was they, our they, used to, they used to play for Medieval. Yeah, yeah. so yeah. you know, if you play for Medieval, you stand a chance to you just want to have your head for your body for when you get your exam for do. You can pass, you look at 10% or 5% test for so you do to end up in a class. Is that what I say? So yeah. But Tell the truth, man. And for me personally, my Manning Cup runs them was to make my name. In because I realize that, yeah, we get, we lose some money. We play football with some man. We never love the ball game. Like. Yeah, they never I never love it. Like. Yeah. Never, and and I'm going to see the coach. I, I'm going to see my coach love them more than me and sacrifice for them more than me. And me at all, I tell say, yo, yo, if we we'll ever know far more and carry this thing, I got money. So we got through some seasons where, yeah, me not have nothing proud for talk about. Me not have nothing proud for talk about, but for myself. Yeah, as, as seriously, team, still, you know, seriously, still, uh, you're not going to get into it because a man is fast and gone still, but you got a raw deal at the Brook State. You know, you know the school of money is more. Yeah. Yeah. No, but yeah. I know, but the people need to know, you know because sometimes people like yeah. people don't re realize Fine. that a player like you, you got a raw deal in high school, but it never stopped you. Because, but, but go ahead and share your, your story still. You understand me? Go ahead. Let me give you some journey. Like, I couldn't take losing game in the money. 
So when I lose all game, you know, I feel all shame and everyone want to come to school all the next day. You know. I saw me carry my thing, you know, so deep, you know, man, in my mind. I say, say, yo, I'm probably with some ball and I lose all game and I go home and I bust, you know, man. I see you a boy and girl school. Yeah, my dad wants to play anyway, prefer the girl like, more than the ball game. You know, so. Ball game was like, yeah, you know. But, you know, for big up some, so some players where, where, they have the intricate. I'm going to bring in Claude Davis. I'm going to bring in Claude Davis. Because wherever him there around the world, you know. Yeah. It, some it, people, some people don't remember that you played with Claude Davis and Kid Tyrell was there. But, and I'm going to bring, bring in Claude Davis, make the world know, <laughs> no, man. But, but oh, opportunity set in life. You feel yeah. me? Claude Davis, am my apprentice when he comes mm -hmm. to school, you know. Yeah, Junior, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I, I, that's another individual where Waga through minor league and these league, Waga's scouting ability was to pick up. Yeah, get him in. So because Claude, he, got, he got this player named Cadian Williams. I think he used to play forward and Tyrell. Tyrell Tyrell was a Meadowbrook in there. All right, the Tyrell them is a family. So I, I mean, call them Ryder. They call all of them Ryder, but a Tyrell is the name, right? So Tyrell they come from a family bunch. Big brother play for the school. Brother play for the school, brother play for the school. Them live across the road from the school. So, yeah, well, and the Wagga never really have much to do with them coming in. But, like, Keegan, who you called before, yeah, only for other yeah. players. Yeah, but Claude Davis. Claude. I try to show you how, 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 how the thing rough in a Meadowbrook. You know? Feel me? Claude Davis took Meadowbrook to a Walker Cup final 1996 versus Tivoli where them lose. Now that team now was coached by Billy Lyons, William Lyons, uh Waga the transfer now and Ghana. Calabar. Calabar, yeah. Last time I deal it. So every day of training, Waga had one style of training, you know. You come, you run your 10 laps. And when you finish your 10 laps, you must do your technical drill. You have to dribble with the ball at pace, chop the ball with the outside of your foot, chop the ball with the inside of your foot, flat over the ball, and then give you them in a sequence, you know, three minutes with that, three minutes with that, three minutes with that, go at pace. And then you have to go through your heading process. Yeah, after you finish all that, you go through your jacket. I depend on where I learned the jacket long time. So when Claude them come in, you know, Claude them are some, and we teach them how to we them learn how to because me had forward. So I'm never teaching to play defense. And you saw life would take the thing. Claude and Cadian Williams. Cadian come from Primbacal Primary to you know. Yes. Right? Claude and Cadian Williams. Watch our choices going on, Omar. Them two players chose, well not chose. Them talent took them to Azad United. My talent took me to my backyard. Marvel, you and them. Choices, you know. Choices are the club where you choose. And you see, Claude shoot off from Hazard to Portmore to Title to Jamaica to. Because him there in a body of people where. Me not have nothing, you know, uncle back of me, you know, man. And me have yeah. to push yourself, you know, man. So, even within high school, every player will come in, even though me did it like five, six years before them. Come get love from the coaches, them. And I say, yo, how about this? How about this, man? And you so it end up now, Omar. I still a knock it in them. I don't know if nobody still a knock it in them. But I still a knock it as a Meadowbrook, man. It's the same purpose I want to start off with. Love, man. I make people love it, man. And time them leave the venue, man. People put up something to say, man. The legends, them sit it in them. We start mentioning the legends, them, you know, man. Whoa. Legends them set it, yeah. I just them youth I know for understand and carry on. But my high school life, I don't know, baby life. Yeah, me have yeah. to dig it myself, Omar. Dig it up myself, my own of fame. Yeah, me dig it up myself. Me and God Almighty. Yeah. So, so all right. So when you left Meadowbrook, no, your first club you stopped at was Constant Spring. No. That's why I love your program in a pastor. <laughs> love you. Love you. First step I'm making up. Yeah. 
the while playing for Meadowbrook High School. Marvel in the day in the Premier League. Oh, 1993. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Marvel in the Premier League. Yeah. So, I play Premier League that same year there while me I play schoolboy football. So, schoolboy football finish, I go join Marvel team. Right? The only thing about that team there was we get regulated. Right? We get demoted. Right. Because it's Angasha cool. was on that team as well. Yeah. A few yeah. of us as, as schoolboy footballers, they get exposed right away, just like how Claude and Cadian and Robbie Scott. Yeah. Right, they are getting exposed over Hazard side with Fabian and Davis then. So school I I I and you know Steve Green already. Steve Green I play big man football for him in a first time. Yeah. Yeah, I play big man football. So few of us they really yeah set that talent there from youth. <coughs> Sorry. All right. Marvel I'm a first team I play big man football. Right? While me I go to school and them get demoted and while they were in the major league. Trying to come back up. So I spent two seasons I play major league for Marvel the UN then. Before we decide to call you know Oma. We did a Marvel in we did the same. We, we did the same corrupting. Same corrupting. Because me live at Glendale. Marvel is a community, say. So Glendale people have to go over there to play. And me and my friends then from Glendale, the same bunch them who play President Cup and we give just as much equal sacrifice as I go to Marvel in Marvel. What are they are training, no man? When money are issued, you no know, man. Ah, oh, Jesus, I will, I will last if we do get money. Forget, sir. So, you know, just remember. Yeah, yeah, it's, I want to. Oh, oh, oh my, you have some money. No. Hold on, let me, pause, no, let, me pause, let, let me pause and say this. If me yeah. ever do this, if me never, like, because when you re remember McLeish, me forget to tell the people them. For those of you who live down there, they call him Marky. Yeah, man. One left, man. One left, yeah, Marky. If you yeah, ever. Man. If you ever think that Mark him, you know, forget to say you name Mark, you understand? Because me and him play whole football together. So we just so you know, so we remember. But yeah. just for the people who don't know it, they call him kind of so, Indian, Indian kind of year like, right? So, Mark. Andre McLean. Yeah. One left. One left, Mark. But go ahead. Tell him one left no more because if him catch it on the right and kick it, you're net boss same way. Yeah. But go ahead and continue the story. Yeah, man. So, we are always again. You were talking about the corruption in, the in um... Yeah, man. As a youth, man, you did it some man, and you want to do the best for your club, man. And them times, they're just individuals. You know, you don't have nobody. You don't know oh, Jesus. You don't know you have some clubs like we are. And i right now. We are trying to build back ourselves. Honestly speaking, in the name of God Almighty. But during them days, the man, the top man, them, who spend the money, man. And you when you come at training, and you play a match, man. Everyone pity them. Everyone pity them, on The taller them, man. The, the season ball of them, Ellie Meyer, of them, League of them, Al Quarry Campbell. Yeah, you, you, you name them. All, all, all ballers will come from out of port, come in, come get money. I Fidel Hamilton. I one time I have a start import a type of baller come, come play them Premier League team. You know? The same thing they did dimming as a youth, man. Dimming Omar, man. I'm telling man. You don't know all the clubhouse because we used to camp down at Blink's place, you know. I tell you, say, I'll play a match for you, match for you, match for you, come in. And, yeah, where you get for you, match for you. I say, no, nah, sir. And you say, my fame, why me tapping up? You know? love me for you. In a them time, they get around 5,000 a week or 10,000 a week. Yeah. Me get 5,000 or 10,000 a week, man. My mother smile, man. When me, the guarantee, do Omar. Right? Me not be one of the man them who they, I, 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 I I demand them who sponsor the star and them, them money. Yeah, when me they try ensure is me they want to stay on the little journey and make sure say see if my mother getting a light bill and my mother getting a water bill or she getting a bill we need to pay. Me just carry go over there and say, yo, pay that bill. So as a schoolboy, I get bills paid. So a little journey they know say things I get deal with. Yeah, it I get deal with whether by cash or by kinds. You understand? But yeah, as yeah. I don't know. And you want to see if you buy your shoes, and you want to see if you do this, and you want to see if you have to say, yo, what you know, man? I'm a chain shipping you know? And it wasn't merely for money either, you know. Because right now, as I'm standing up, know? yeah, we want one of them ballers. Yo, know? I'm, I'm the foolish baller in Jamaica. I'm on the other side. I'm the foolish football. No, you know, no, man, you can't say that, man. You can't say that. I'm in the brook, you're going up. Know? When you make the Medabrook people, they get money. Or if you go to the brook, you call yourself fool, man. 
Come on. Let me know. Let me know. Kind. You're the one of the most kind hearted baller. <laughs> Let me know. I met Mark Robinson. But the journey was to be. I want to get highlighted in my island. Yeah, I want, want that fame there, like a Brazilian fame over so. If I walk any street, I want that fame there in my island. So I say, yeah, what? I jump. Because two semi-finals were going to lose to Marvalina. And the two teams that were beat you know, Ghana Premier League, you know, Waterhouse and Olympic Yard. Right, beat to a semi-final them guys. So I say, nah man, a time in a play, a time to carry on the thing. And with the whole of corruption, we say we're gonna carry something. Here the joke before me end up a spring. My friend got cancer spring, Nathan Carnegie went to spring. Because Nathan and one of them youth that got college, you know. So it mixed up with whole of college mind you. So I have a whole of friends at Cancer Spring. You understand? Likewise, Meadowbrook High School was aligned to Cancer Spring. Yeah. Yeah. But everybody I use the route. I just say my community first and see what we can carry it. And then afterwards. All right. So let me let me just say this. Don't forget that we have a farmer, Meadowbrook High School teacher, in the in listening in on it says Meadowbrook High School students are no fools. <laughs> I am no, 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 no. I saw I saw splendid at Lux Vestra. So they, they, yeah, you yeah, tell, tell us what that means, you know. Yeah, man, that means let your light so shine. All right. <laughs> but let everything boy you shine. Yeah. Right. Uh, so, so, yeah, I, 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 I know. so continue but, the concern spring. Right. So. Yeah, you know, I know, Omar, no. Because I have to bring in everything in there. You can't leave earth and daughter, too. We say we're going to go spring, but my best friend, my best friend at the time, Nathan, the twin gone and spring. And him, him sees me, you know what I mean, a coach, the team were named Dennis Blake, DB Bazavak. Oh, that's a Spanish town. More of a Spanish town. Them did just get promoted a up into the Premier League. Yeah. All right. And it was coached by Mr. Williams. Mr. Clive Williams, ask the man who did the ass racing them and them thing that Cliff yeah. Williams. Cliff Williams, <laughs> yeah, man. Eric Williams, because Eric Williams, in brother, live in a Glendale. Too. So, we we'll play an under 20 game, which I mean, mash up. Every time I talk about an under 20 game, then I kind of cast my team a finals. Because we lose the finals 5 2 in the stadium. And I'm my fault. But another story. Anyway, I know about DB Bazava. No, I don't know nothing about Spanish Town, no, Omar. But I know, say, what you know? Twin God up, so. I don't mean, want a friend feel like me. I follow them. Big man. I said, I want to do my way. First, I go for my own, out of port now, you know. See? So I said, I go to you. Mother don't like it because mother don't like when time I go to Garrison team. Mother like cancer and spring, notion. The notion of spring, that sweetheart, uptown tea. Yeah. See, Spanish town, them time there. Rivoli, where they are going now, over. Um, what do you call the place there again? Eh? Uh, De La Vega. I mean, De, La, De La Vega and... Yeah, over there, man. Yeah, 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 man. One of them, one of them clans, man, they didn't have big war them time. Them time, they didn't even know. Them time, they didn't even know. Yeah. know. One of them clans, man, you know. We just know that the team are trained at prison overall. Yeah. Do me. Their favorite baller, their best baller was a youth named Chris. I don't know if I burn it, burn it, but I know his name is Chris. I have a scar in my face. Anyway, we see each other, see we will still see them. I don't know him, you know, but one but once we see each other, a mad love. Cause I think he's in an entertainment. God rest him soul that he's alive. Because something I lose all the friend I know. So Chris, hope you're alive. But I end up over there and do some training session. And then Mr. Williams come to me and tell me, say, you know, say we never can pay you like much. I mean, I said, no, we can't run from Marvel if we come way over here so we come deal with gate receipt payment again, man. We can't deal with that. I can't deal with that. So, Omar, God, no, I don't uh, know what to do now. I don't know what to do. You know, so I'm going to watch my friend at train. Up a spring. Uh, I don't have nothing to say, I don't go back. I don't make no more trip go over this. So, I'm going to watch a train train. I'm go training with him. Sit down up in the stands and, you know, I see the greats, them, the travel them, 
Oh boy, the Marvin Chin, uh, Moses Brown, yeah, Watkins. Then we're just a, 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 a Manning Cup winner with Napsack on him back as captain of Excelsior. Yo, names goes on, man. Blakey, names goes on. Yeah, I know. And then Shusha Brown, now, Garfield Brown, which is a Meadowbrook legend, in come to the stands and in the hallways. I said, Come. I was just a cop. I know me lost. Me don't know what to do. So I say, hey. And say, yeah, hear me? Yeah, I go to Danny Lini now. When I go to Danny Lini, I'm going to ask you. What you want? Why are you here? And I say, one thing you must not tell him. Don't tell him say you come for playing about. So, you know, fix up your argument. Yeah, man, I'm going to make it happen, man. Go in at the training session. Look how life set now, you know. Friend, they're there before me, you know. Ghana training session. BT me depa. And Daniel in power and say, no nah, man bada so. You know bada so. Yeah man. No nah, nah, man bada. That's a big civil brother people for yeah. those of you don't know. The yeah, love goes out. So all too well. Um put him on the A team. So I put him on the A team, left back. And I tell me into the left back thing. I don't know nothing about left back till 1991. You know. A goal my band for scoring. You know. Let me say Mark and them tell you, man. Make, make Marco McDonald. Make Steve yes. Green tell you. <laughs> make, make primary school boy tell you what my band for do. My band for bust net. Run round people <laughs> and bust their net. At 1991, my coach just set me and told me that this left back here, man. Told yeah. me that this. I, I saw the defending starting, you know, Omar. I saw the defending journey starting. You know. So, anyway, yeah. I'm simply a left back on this now, this now going to be 1996. Because 1995, I'm a last year of school and my last year of, of with Marvali. Because we make a journey. We make a journey within that school year, there, you know. You see me? Yeah, when we are telling the book, the book I'll be telling you. Know, we make a journey we're not supposed to make and go get yourself involved in our foolishness. You understand? And lose out one time or three months worth of time over another country. You understand? So when he comes, no, definitely not in the West. So I say, watch, you know, when I go up a spring and the opportunity given where I start playing left back and start focus on the ball game. Because I hear the nice you now, we have album with it, you know, with whole heap of things where take place from nowhere to semi-final, you know, where Siba lift you up. Patrick Reed, you no, know, Siba D with we are way in our stadium after we are leading one love down our country. Then. Yeah. But yeah. within the whole mix of training, my friend now, I love my friend. So every day with their training, I want me and him make the team. But my friend, they love sitting up on the bench. My friend, they cool with sitting down on the bench. In good, I come off of the bench. In good. Me never want that. He want to start. So in a training session, when he relax and them thing and the coach, I pressure him. Me all I pressure him too. Me I pressure him too. Come on, yo. You know, one evening we go home together and the man give it to me, man. Yeah, man. My friend give it to me, man. Man say, yo, bridge, become a man team and just in a man's skin. We are go out, we are come there for. Get it, get it, man. Yeah, right. So go. Let me give you, let me give you some yeah. of the comments that are coming in for you. Um, goalkeeper for don't be old and Damian yeah. says yeah, Jingle man. White. Damian, love Damian, man. Love, Damian, man. Yeah, love, man. love, love yeah, the jungle man. experience, you know. Me and him start the jungle experience same time, you know. I okay. see a good time champion out there. You see me, I say. Yeah, man. We're going to get to that. Claudia says, she was talking about the met, met, met motto that says, let your light shine. Then Ricardo Baggio says, I'm your warlord. What became of Michael Williams, a.k.a. Big Head? No, nah, man. Big Head, man. Big Head still a spread love, man. Big Head, I run him on like a taxi, you know. With love and respect. Still don't do any park same way where I'm going to respect, you know. Cause I, I saw the ball game go, you know. For we, it going to respect. So we still yeah. living longer in our whatever community we live. We get yeah, preference. Man. And then you know? Carlton Alexander, former what other player and coach, Cluggy, says respect, yep. Warlord. Come on. Um, yeah, yeah, man. Dana yeah. Bonito said that the player you're trying to remember is Chris Howell from over the yes. years. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Thank you very much, Bonito. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, man. Uh, and, and, then, and yo, 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 you see Wes? You see Wes Omar? You see, what are the Siba Violet Kickers? The Reno team, the lad. Yo, yo. We soon, we, soon, we soon get to some of that, man. Um, yo! Yeah. 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 
Yo, 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 God, that's for you. Hey, yo. Love you, Braxton. Yeah, <laughs> Yeah, man. And then this is this is um Elvis Hart. Elvis Hart is from Village. He's a key for Village. You know yeah. Saying? Yeah, man. Warlord, glad to see the ball. Bless up hey. yourself, my brother. Elvis Hart. Village I'm, 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 I, oh, 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 hey, Jano, I want United, man. Jano, me and him in a stress then. Can you if I find my United fan, me and him in a stress. Yeah. Cheers this now. Chris went a big up man in this, man. Love. Jingo passion for the football. He made, he, he made a real deal. Yeah, yeah man. man. Anything less is uncivilized, man. Mm. Yeah, man. So, yeah, so you had, you say, you, you mean you had, um, and then Brian Martin says that, um, Farmer Mullins, assistant coach, you understand me? Love you, love you, love you. Yeah, man. And then, um, Leon Reynolds says, biggest coach in the world. What? Yeah, man. Watch and there you go. Yeah, man. So, <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. So, at Constant Spring, Siva beat you in the semifinals that year. I mean, you played a couple more seasons before you moved from Constant Spring. Sneakingly. Hey, share, share that with us, man. And where you ended up after leaving. In a middle of the night. Yeah. <laughs> Joy. Yeah, I'm tell <laughs> Hey, hey, hear me, man. You see, it, here, you see, Constant Spring, love. Are the only team you can play for where you can sick or no? We have got a match and a year turn for rest. And you're good for lie down in your team here, lap or lean down on them shoulder. You're good. Yeah, and a whole if a team you can do that. Them love them and death. Constant spirit. But guess what go on? Bad or so. So after we come so and come back the following year, things start to take a look at change. Mm-hmm. Me say, me say, Brown, Brown, come in. Ask Not Brown. Dirty Brown, but him brother. Ask him, yeah, Brown, come in. <laughs> yeah, Ask him really. to have a fabulous season with what other them, you know? Yeah, yeah. Him and me. he came to Constant Spring. Ah, Ask him, Brown, come in. And all of a sudden now, me start to see me give him. Me give him up. I'm mean, not getting an explanation about it either. You know, like that train all week, and my mind set for play, and then you dip on the bench. And I said, I don't understand this. I don't understand what I go on. I don't mean, I mean, I like this. But guess what they start going now? You see that Meadowbrook link up there with Nama Manley? Yeah, and yeah. You pick up the paper in a 96, 97, 97, 98, when you pick up the paper. Damian Powell. We're going man the name again, Kirk Martin. Yeah. Alan Nash. Leo Arton. Yeah. No, yeah. I'm not at school, but me and the normal man the player then. The Irvino the, English. Irvino and the Pete. I'm gonna say, what's in a man? I wonder if we're a fitting. Seriously, no man. Oh my rest of me not have no. I'm not an agent, you know. my brother David Griffiths and Shamari Griffiths and my brother them. So when we, you know, when we at home, them, my, them we wait. But I like, I have nobody around me where. So more time I make my decision, then most of the time, 99% of the time, I'm my home, I make my decision. So when them, them bad, I just take a blame. I sit down tomorrow and I say, yo, I wonder if I'm a fit in another team there. I really wonder, you know, Omar, a team that they on a run. Because what I tell you, say, what was beat, the Marvel team. In our semi final, and from this, I know you know the first year, you know, Jeffrey Maxwell, the thing they set away, whereas they have all a quarter final round, you know, to play. Yeah. So, what out now, you could have taken all players from all major league and play for all the team if them all out and you could have used them and them, the core of them and anguish of them, then play for them. You understand? Some of them I said, No, nah, man, you know, said them always are talking about Jeffrey Maxwell. Said Jeffrey Maxwell can't coach you because you, know, you can't make Jeffrey Maxwell team. I know what they used to say in the past. No, you can't make him team. But me, I said, but then you tell us let's go. I'm not going good. Yeah, you hear me? We're going to play a game, a country, Omar, and lose to Siba. We lose the game around our one spot there, around our alligator pond spot there, then carry going to play down a country there. What I tell you, boy? <laughs> All the field look like one of them desert places, the sunshine for it, a be a cracking at the ground, you see. We we'll get a tree, look. There's a constant spring. Constant Spring. 
and it's on the journey coming back, you know. Smile on my mind and say, yeah, you hear me? January around the corner, you know. Yeah, give this a shot, you know. Yeah. And the first thing I tell her, I'm a same friend. Nathan Carnegie. Can you get all blame for you? Can you hold a secret to me until Danny Lynn cuss him and say, you had this and you had that. You didn't know. But it's never easy. Because even know Omar, we are going to the camp there where a Jews land, we are going over here, Omar. Jews land, hot enough. Yeah, yeah, leave from Mars to the Jews land. Hot! <laughs> Jeffrey of them, and me know, me know, me know, me, like, oh yeah. I carry myself go over there. Me and a few of my friends them walk go over there. I beg them a walk, beg them a strength. Uh, and the water spans them too, you know, within themselves. So I go watch training session. And while going over there, me have in my mind. Now I go to him. I go to him for my own. Jeffrey Maxwell, the evening. Introduce myself. Watch him thing I know, you know. Craig White. Yeah, who is Craig White? Where you come, come from? Kansas Spring. Kansas Spring. Uh, what position do you play for them? And play left back in. You know? Um, how much percentage of game you play for them? So I said about 80, 85 percent. But I've lately they kind of diminished. And right, they say, you know, oh my. The man said to me, say, you know, say, we have an injured player. So I make all those team, you know, man, just make me come in at the team, come train you now with an injured player, Kurt Martin, out for an injury. And them time the water house, I play the three defender and four midfield and three forward. And Omar, the day I touched that ground, the day I touched that ground, the first blessing I reached me was from you, Bingy Blair. He meet me before I reached the field. And him give me a pair of Reebok boots. And you know who was the star for USA them time there? Eric Ronaldo. So you know, says uh, Eric Ronaldo, Reebok boots, we'll get you know. Give it to me, you know, as well. Come in, you know. Yeah. So you see more time, me there do the work. And I say, who oh, am I? While the work I do, and people are notice, and I say, yo, Mono mind him come in, you know. So you see that water step in there. With Jeffrey Maxwell at the aim, it was it was a journey of yeah because to make a name in the country you have to win titles. Understand? I'm gonna go right now, team. We are poised to win the Premier League. Yeah, so we draw me draw my string right. Let me say what you done. Me I leave spring not because I lack of love now or nothing you know, but because my sister watch you know. You see where them set a man you deal with over your son? It don't look like a really title thing them man you deal with. It. And them man you got all right in a life. Me need a title in my life. So anyway, me step, people yeah. can recognize I can't see one TV I win the title, you know. I can name Craig White, you know. Yeah. So that was my main purpose in for not gaining that little thing that name win trophy, you know. The only disappointment thing I want us is that we never see us ball going doubles and triples. Yeah, but well, you, 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 you won a title at Waterhouse. Two. Two Premier League titles, yeah. Yeah. So, I'm sure I'm sure. Hey, so the next time, Cho. Sure. Yeah. Sure. Hey, hey, Fuzzy. <laughs> but you won two titles at Waterhouse. And you, and you went to Arnett Gardens as well. But you went to Arnett Gardens, you went to August. Did you win any titles at Arnett Gardens? Let me tell you, Arnett Journey. Kirk Ramsey. And we're big head name. Eugene Williams. No, man. I don't want, no, not a Eugene. They want Roger Rodney. Oh. They have so much big head in the league them time. Roger Rodney. Kirk Ramsey. Ka Ka and Kadula. No. Don't, 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 don't. Yeah, man, Kirk Ramsey, yeah, man. Kirk Ramsey and Roger Rodney gave yeah. me a call. Now, it happened that 2005, 2006, right? That was Watto's second 
Premier League title. Yeah. It's the separate from the 97, 98. So, I think the things start to take turn. Fearclough was the coach. Fearclough, Bingy, and Fuzzy finish up that championship season. 2005, 2006, yeah. Yes. Holy corruption. Holy party. Irvina English. I love you. Love you. Anyway, you're them a bad man friend over. So love you, love you, love you, love you. Your soul rest. Irvina English, they have a yeah, let's call it an episode season. Where my kick out wind and I mash up things and when you're ready to take all the red card for you and the reason. And, yeah, so the season they are down the tree. Yeah. Story be told this, you know. Yeah, true story be told. So, we went over country and come back over with a loss again. Can't remember which one of them country there we go, but we come back over with a loss and a decision was made in you know, the changing room. At no longer them have met Irvine you know, the captain to finish off the season. Irvine, I'm mean, not a chap there anymore, but yeah, listen. No longer ever make Irvine you know, the captain for the rest of the season. Because I me mean, I say, the kind of, yeah, the erraticness and would they look Ir- I mean, Ir- Ir- Irvine you know, English is not alive, you know. Yeah, yeah, I mean, no, no, I'm a big mom, see him where like him alive, man. I know that man. Oh, 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 oh. No, 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 but go ahead. But go ahead and share that story up. Yeah. With the, the captain it. from Irvino. All right. The team decides, say, Baggy Warlord. Warlord, you're captain the team. But that the commander, that 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 that, that, that never does. You understand? I remember say at the war this now, you know, who who went time we are. Yeah, we are captain without the band long time. Because yeah. When it comes to game time, everybody accountable time. Yeah, so you me, 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 me not take it from you, say, yeah, everything all right when me I say yes. Yeah, then decides to make you warrior the captain band under the sea or under circumstances, say warrior for watch all you. But Liam did just step on that right away. Kevin Liam step on that right away and say, yo, hear me, no man. When you know war stay already in you know? them. Come in. So you see from January. The captain. The ship gets sturdy or so we propel each other to win the title 2005-2006. Right? So Irvino are the team captain overall. But on the journey there for the rest of the rounds, them coming up. Me lead the team. And go forward. After that, now fear cloth leave. I look to come back. And then something they come in. Cabra. Cabra come in, you know. And yeah, things start get away and I remember so when Fear Club them come in and you know, Peter Cargill the dead before and then the uh, Peter lose him life. So a whole heap a roller coaster with their got you in. So here comes Cabra now. All of a sudden now, he's a nobody. Winning captain, you know. Come like nobody now from bench every game, you know. So I take time there away my mind again. I just know my journey go already. When time I start to feel like it's time to move and spread love somewhere else, I start think about it. So, season up. Kirk Ramsey and Roger Rodney call my phone telling me that them out of Arne Garden and they are with coach. I'm going to forget coach name, man. He used to coach August Town and him always there on Peter Cargill them time there. You know. Coach name again, man. Ja, um, Max Tra. Max Tra. Coach Max Tra. <laughs> so because of the relationship where him and yeah. Peter Cargill they have together when them come at Waterhouse, it was good because I saw now I get to meet Richard West and Edwards and when we defend we didn't defend we didn't defend the name of um Adrian Adrian Reed three Santos you that come in one time you know we love them 
still a nice little band. I'll camp with them when we in a room and we together. But yeah. it's so happened that different things started. Man, them call me at a time when time I think about something. I say, yo, you know what I on it, Yard? Yeah, we'll come out of on it, you know. And Max Straw there. And I said, Bumba, Max Straw, blows and skirt. You know, so because Cargill lose him life. And yeah, since Max, I'm assistant and friend for years. Yeah, they must have good coaching tantra. You know, so I give Max Straw a season. I want a change. I take a change. Go to a jump. So I end up a jungle, you know. Whereas, we spent three seasons out there, we know we nothing, you know. We know we yeah. not tight, you know. But to get a part of their culture, you know, when I play against the nemesis them for years, and as I tell you now, when he when walk in, you know, Omar, yeah, it's no more like me, it's a nemesis, you know. So it's more like, welcome. Welcome. Yeah. So when we go to know, you know the family, right? You, you know the family of all of them. Some of the five five there, there. Like a Colonel Chin Su, there, the Pele, there, yeah, there. Man. there, there yeah. Um, Ram, you're the goalkeeper. Um, I had come in now as a young goalkeeper now for start behind a Ram, you take Ram game. Yeah. I'm there with some defenders now where I grow. I grow so much where me now I, I develop who play beside of me. Because as you yeah. also play the sweeper position, now we are play center back position more often more than left backs are anyway now. So we grow. So we, we are take all Kunta and make him know say, yo, stay upon your foot now, my youth, and done them 10 years ago, think them are youth. People for have tear in away without we have. Yeah. So we groom. We groom so much where we are max try make a six game run undefeated, you know. Yeah. In sheet where cash plus are they. Once at them time there, we get our clash, but we get our cash for we are in all them trophy I know. Man of the match, king of the match, cash plus trophy though, that boy is told away. We, we, yeah, we give them a one love at. But the points never rock up enough. And show up me told, because that with they have to do. The jungle ball of them, they kind of more of a Reluctance to who are coming at them team come lead. So while me uh, a big team, I know, yeah, me was like bigger, maybe bigger than the accept bigger more. You understand? But Wally Parif, them fire Maxtra, all type of changes. That year, the Arnett Garden, they are the bottom of the six, you know. A Jerome, we had come back, come, come. Story be told that year. 2006, 2007, when I we went there, for when I went there, bottom six, we are back up, you know. Let me give you all the story, you know. I see by United, our last game, down at Moby, Jared Park, you know. I saw Siba get demoted instead of we, you know, because we win the final game. Any one of them two teams, they win. Stay up. And Siba lose and come out of Premier League. Who ends now, them change to Mobile. Mobile United. Wow. All right. So let me ask you, and because we have a, you know, we have around uh, twenty or so minutes, twenty or so minutes to go. Because a lot, you know, because we didn't get to what happened at August Stone. There's a, there's a, there's a, there's an art part two. That yeah, that yeah, because that came out in the newspaper about some problems yeah. with Waterhouse. I don't know if you want to do that or you want... I mean, but let me, let me ask you this question. I mean, have you ever been called up to any national program, any national team at any point? Hey. I love you, God. Shout that loud. Guess what happened? The one time we make a change, I will go to earn it, yeah. So I'm going to come out of the likes now. We're not surrounded by now. Breaking Bridge, you know, surrounded by no Marco McDonald, you know, surrounded by no Waterhouse player, you know, I'm all from my own in a defense line with total different players. And as me tell you, said, the first six, seven games there, back line, seal. Yeah, me start take clean sheets, serious. 
me take clean sheet serious i suck and me get a one call up out of on it girl me get a one call up you know yeah i'm gonna spend a one week in our national camp with the national them who did it you understand never get the chance eh? done even a practice match you know but we we'll make some national journey where we see them travel and them bus and see the trip with them make and yeah. you know the organization and we see the timing factor. Watch out. The first meeting we had when we go up on the camp, a one week camp. Simo is just come back. First meeting. You know how late me. Who pulled me? Late. One minute late. Yeah, and everybody I look for me. You ever feel like fool there? Uh, uh, <laughs> the boy is the great the boy is a big late. Never banish me still. Uh, you don't know a first year and a first time. Yeah. Right? So let me all right. But learning so, lesson. Yeah. Yeah. So let me ask you um just that's a, a different because we need to one of the we're going to have an next one we talk about the whole August town and some other things that happen yeah. in your career. But tell me some of the players that I mean some of the players that you played against that because of how good they were, you respect the game. Because you understand me, and then tell me some of the players that you played with that I mean you really respect those players. I mean you respect all the players, but some of them are really special, and you enjoy playing with them. And those who yes, when you come up against a forward, there, you know, a trouble. You understand me? Give me some of those players in your career. <coughs> hey, anywhere. I'm gonna name on some strike. I enjoyed running down Paul Teague at Davis. <laughs> Dead. Yeah. I enjoyed running down Everall Bully Peddy, even on my own training session over Marvel. Dead. You have the Pelle Wilson, even what day. It was a joy for running down now. Look at Masters League practice game over the park. Yeah. <laughs> love fellow with him. Love playing against him. I enjoyed planning a how am I going to stop Boot and Shelton? How am I going to stop Boot and Shelton to the boy? Run, pan, run, pan, run. The tailor, you know, the whole power organization, what a harbor. Ronaldo, are you talking on the. <laughs> Tier four, four Benny. Tier four Benny was a little maga boy where just run around him. <laughs> yeah, he might he might fear be a dark kid, Ronaldo. Yeah. You know, <laughs> don't, don't want to chill on it there. Yeah. You know, a host of them. You know, a host of them as far as where well. I just say it I gotta take another time. You need to write down a list so I can just call them out consistently. You know? yeah, what about some of your teammates? You know that play. you play with, with from uh, you know. I know you I call Angasha and you call Marky and Angasha and those guys from your, 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 your you know, uh, primary, my primary school. school they, all right, you see, you see that 19, say a 1989 primary school team. Then. You know, if I go in a coma, yeah, I'll have to do a stick back from that 1989 team. Then. I'm going to wake up on that. Because even I'm stressful days then, I think back from all of them. It's a Morgan boys, you know. But it's special as you step up, you know. And right now, the likes of the CSM family, you know, we I play with right. Brenton Smith, them and the elders, them right now in a business about fuss and cuss. It's a joy, you know, for be a part of that. The Waterhouse team, the Waterhouse winning team with Jeffrey Maxwell, with Bingy Blair and Gregory Hall and Rowan in at the goal, and you know. Alberta Frey, Damian Powell, you know, Dutty man, them calling them time. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Think man. he's watching too. <laughs> Hicklin, you know, yo, you know, my Waterhouse and, journey. Andre Hicklin. Journey with Steve Green, yeah. Mark Donald, you know, Christopher Nicholas, even though me and him have big fight. Me and him have big. But, you know, me enjoy, me enjoy everywhere I went. Yeah, some of the persons here, um, um, a couple of your, your, your persons, your coach, this is Anthony Forsythe, 
Send oh, 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 all right, watch out now. Uh, uh, Antoine, for, uh, um, I'm a look at under 13, under 13 right. ball of this, you know. Yeah. Uh, they kill me. I say, give me the link, give me the link. Yeah, and then, and, and then, and, Jay, and then, yeah, Jay, you know me? So, you know, every day we try to get them the truth, Omar. You know, yeah, I can't, I can't, I can't do it, Omar. I don't know how to Yeah. No, but then, yeah, you also have Jay Z in there as well saying, yo, coach, that's one of your players as well. Yeah, and, Jay. Um, yeah, and yeah, then, yeah, I'm a you Mari X, I'm a brother, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, him saying yeah, you got one title. Man. You got one title with Jeffrey Maxwell and one with Peter Cargill. No, no, I missed up on it. It's a Peter Cargill, it drop out, you know. You see me? A fear club come finish the season, man. A fear club and Bingy and Fuzzy finish the season, man. We will win that title, man. So Fuzzy have a title, you know. Fuzzy have a title as an assistant coach, you know. But boy, what a Jesus crime. Hey, all right. What me thought this round now? You see the longer Waterhouse take for win Premier League, eh? Yeah. And the longer we stay legends. <laughs> and then they can't see go and play, 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 play. And run put a more pleasant team and we are plan more pleasant. Well, we need to know. More players. <laughs> yeah. You know, them big money spending thing that and they want a joke thing that yeah, yeah, you know. So, <laughs> hey. Yeah. Hey. Yo, you see Waterhouse unity is strength, 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 strength. Yeah, definitely. Good for definitely. no, Omar. It's good yeah. for no. It's good yeah, for no. People, a lot of people say, you know, when they look at your game, they must say, oh, them kind of ball game there. World out. And them when they come, they come, they say, world out. Them kind of, and they, they say, like, them kind of ball game there. Don't. Them kind of ball game that Couldn't work nowadays and thing. That is what the younger players must say. Them, I found us a ball play now, you see a big thing. What do you say to those people who, you understand me, think like you couldn't, you couldn't play in these times in the league? <clears throat> Because of how they see has been this aggressive defender. I would say the game has changed and revolved. It's true. Even now I can tell the players them that you have to be on timing when you're going to make that slight tackle. You know, there are certain tackles where yeah, you can't do no more. You know what I mean? You know, yeah, remember you say you get a kick for no reason. You say you get kicked for no reason. You know? <laughs> <laughs> so you, 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 you have time where you could uh, you know, yeah. a boy, you know, say, yo, don't come back over this side, please. You know, but, but in terms of, look, if I win this football thing open and the Masters League body can get a wider vision of how they, how they get we out there, get the Masters League teams them out there, you know. Yo, if people come and watch some Masters League game, man, they won't be saying what they're saying, man. <laughs> uh, 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 hey, 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 yo, listen up, man. Listen up. It's all in a game plan. So, <laughs> just like before, if you come and you make and you get by me two times, you know, me guarantee you say, you know, there won't be no third and fourth. You know, you know, you know, you know, change. Oh, my, you gone far. Oh, my, we are playing some Masters League over. All right. My spring, my spring teammate, them are gonna know now. Whosoever I watch, I gonna know now. Car, watch you know? Marvel play about seven practice game already, you know. Nice, nice, clean, clean, clean practice match, you know. I used to tell the people them come match. You no know, people them leave and say, Why, why? How oh, you do it? Entertainment side, are you know, leave you. Oh my, I'm yeah. not a time for make bad pass. Remember, say, me, I quote some little 13 year old and. And, and, and 10 year old and, and 9 year old when I emphasize upon these things so and it even now even now come watch some Masters League and the Masters League they need to find a way out for me to play again not only play again but fight yeah, but, but I can't stand spring I can't stand spring at the big side in the Masters League still I can't stand spring to lose Masters League man still well you know I lie still the last the last season yeah, we never accomplished the mission and see the boss gone to Aya Evans, you know. Yeah. Oh, you know, it it all get back. It all get back. There. Cause as we said, the love we spring carry and the discipline we have to surround spring, it all always outdo some of the other teams then around. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, man. So we have we have around ten minutes. So what I want you to do is to take some of this time to you know talk to the young footballers because like I said, that your journey 
has been a tough one, especially when a, a youngster grew up without like the, the father kind of um, support. You understand me? And yeah. then the difficulty he had in high school, but you know, still a ho- household name in Jamaica, right? So, you know, just take the time and talk to the youth, them, encourage them. What, what are some of your advice to them um, today, you know? Um, you don't know, it come with work hard. The youth them don't love train no more. So it need work hard and dedication. Follow the dream that as much as we in a Jamaica we listen to too much people bash Jamaica and bash Jamaica feel and bash Jamaica league and all these things. Follow your football dream. And work hard at it every day. Even when you are not at the training session. Whatever you have been taught in the session, practice it at home. That is how you get your technical skills up to par. No matter what distance that ball is coming from, any part of your body will be able to deal with this ball in the right way. But it takes for you to have a strong mindset, meaning as kids right now, you are all captivated by this device. And it's amazing, you know, Omar. They want to be footballers, but they are playing free fire on the phone. I don't understand how that works out. You understand me, Adele? The youth, them now spend time a visualize football events, football stuff, football in the box, out the box. It's more of different stuff over the media. So this is the problem I am having. This is the problem I'm trying to send to minds and other around other coaches who now have a lot of academies around. You must be dedicated to your dream. No make no you tell us that come around the corner, come around the lane. No time for go at training. You understand? And when you be yeah. them with you, everybody will respect you. And you will make it. You will make it. Yeah. All right. So I have some comments here. Um, and, and then I, I'm, going, I'm going to just run them where you can. Um, um, a Prince Man is asking, is that Brenton Simit from Arden and Marky from Marvali? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. All right. Yes, sir. Dan, Dan, Dan Albonita said, love your jingle for your realness. Um, Patrick Reed is laughing, you know. Um, Patrick Reed said, we kill forward. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh, then Tevi Jr. says, at them jingle. Yeah. Uh, love Patrick, it again. Yeah, man. Patrick Reed said, we drive fear into forwards. And then, um, yeah, man. And then he says that if he's going to war, he's bringing, he's taking warlord with him. Um, yeah, man. Let me see if I can get some more. Roger Sharp says, um, real talk baller. Um, and then Tev- Tevi Jr. says again, Mari tell war say, Booker never afraid of him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, you're trying to show something. I don't think they can read. Um, let me see. Uh, it says, Jahari, Ashanti, Ronaldo, Ashanti, Ronaldo. Adore. Jahari, Ashanti, Ronaldo, Adore. Yeah. Yeah. The kids them there. Four they kids. The, they got the kids there, you know? Yeah, man, yeah. look at something about JC, man. Yeah, man, in, in, in depth on the journey, Ronaldo White, in depth on the journey. In there, I'm waiting for my answers. I mean, I was there in the oh. school, in the journey, I have him head for him body, I know where I'm Re- going to like. Remember the name, people, Ronaldo yeah, White. Yeah, man, he can't go, man. He can't go. He can't make it. He can't make it. He can't and make met, it. Metal man say, wow. Ah! <laughs> hey, hey, Omar. Omar, <laughs> you know, say, you know, so when time a ball play to a forward, as Patrick said, I won't want that. Men are like, break both things up. But that many people them know, so me hear them. And then a ball I go to a forward, and the crowd comes and say, what? Me, they even need to do nothing no more. He might let the ball alone. Me, 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 good. Good. I let, I let him decide, say. Yeah, unless in this height set, he more peace at the action. That's fun. That's fun, man. 
<laughs> yeah, definitely. Oh. Definitely. Definitely. Oh. Definitely. Listen, take some time and then song all the persons that you want to song. Hopefully, you know, f- forget any name, but you know, um, I know who you want to say thank you to, or uh, you know, who you want to hear, but it's your time. You know, you heal up the kids already, but the, the time is yours to go my ahead. Grandmother, I'm healing up my grandmother. I'm healing up Glendale. I'm healing up Prembukal. I'm healing up Tree Walks, Marvali, Akiwak, Jackson Town. I want to big up the whole of Red Hills. Uh, watch, I know me, I live at Red Hills for 12 years now. As my son at 12, you know, I'm there at Red Hills, you know. And people at Red Hills call me Bala. Yeah, you have to great in a way you do for people call you Bala. Because if you are a metal man, they might call you a welder. Or if you are an engineer, they might call you. So when they say Bala, you must yeah, do something good. So, all of them big up there in a one shout. You know, in a one shout out. But life where me I live right now, a true God, I'm more to say this, make the world know to Papa. Yeah, Mama Sharon. Yeah, Omar. Yeah, man. When time, when time strangers, when you're there, you're down, you're fierce. Yeah, you don't know where to do, where to go. You don't know where to put your little things them. You don't know where to sleep. And God sends strangers in your eyesight to make them put a roof over your head. And give a life to start and know so you can sleep without you know, the cold. Yeah, so I'm a big up Mama Sharon over England. Big up Ian man, this is Papa. Yeah, over in Canada. Then. Big up on yourself, my love. You know. And the house, good. Now go and take care, right? Because I build up out of wood or boat. I love it. Yeah, man. So, this is the big up there for now, you know, Omar. And you, watch on, man. This is our profile. Because profile on TV, J, profile look like it built for rich people and them people. Yeah, yeah. Yo, profile now have nothing upon you. Let's go on and do this and God continue to bless you and bless your family and bless your surroundings. Because if you don't have good surroundings, we we'll get led astray. You're a powerful man. Yeah. You're a powerful man. Love you. Big time. Yeah, Andre, spread the word. That we do every day. Love you. Yeah, man, yeah, man, respect, respect, respect. People, there you have it, you know. But tell us, uh, he, he has a near warlord, but he's a man of love. Listen, you he meet him. What she has a name to love, lord, you know, but yeah, love, lord. Yeah, I'm telling you, because yeah, somebody want to show it, man, show it, man. Love, yeah, lord. man, is is you understand me? He's a really listen. Once you talk to him, I don't know, you can check his team, it will fight, you know. But yes, when I love. Is real love. It's a real and genuine love and respect and thing and um that that transcended, you know, you know, just into life in general, even outside of the lines. And you know, when they go on the field, it's it's a battle of who is the best. But off the field is one love and one family. I hope that there is something that was said today, you heard today that would have inspired you. That you know, you can learn from Craig's story that sometimes the odds are against you, but you don't have to feel, you don't have to stay where you are, you can get better. You may not have all the support you need, but if you keep working hard, keep dedicating yourself, keep committing to that dream, you can make it. You understand me? Look where you took him from. Took him from, I mean, being treated not in the best way in, in high school to probably excelling. Some of the players who were on that very team that were playing over him. You know, won Premier League titles. Some of them never had the opportunity to do that. You understand? And so sometimes you can't give up. You have to keep, you have to keep fighting. He talked about, you know, dedicating yourself for the younger players and off the field, just training. I tell people all the while that you should never lose because you're unfit. Because you can do that by yourself. You don't need a coach. You have to, if you want to be a professional footballer, you should not have to go to, when you get to the playing ground, the coach should know you're already fit so you can work on some technical and tactical things. I think, like he said, players need to take up their physical conditioning in their hands. So when the coach is about to start training, he says, I don't have to do any jogging and running. No, what all I need to do right now is work on the tactical and the technical skills and ability this the the, the 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 mindset understanding the game so young players i hope you heard that all this all of these players from the past adonis maxwell um the the, the 
Freddie Butler, the Paul Young, the Dean, all of these okay. guys. Remember Adonis Maxwell told you all that he used to go over to the stadium and run all the stairs without a coach. Come off the, 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 the PS5 and the Xbox and the, you know, that not going, yeah. You're not going to use your hands. You're not going to use your hands in the game. You're going to use your head and your feet, man. So here's the thing. Get them busy and get them working. You understand me? Sir White, thank you again. We will talk again, you know. You understand yeah. me? I hope your lovely wife will be available yeah. to help you set up the, the whole yeah. thing when we, we, we do the part two yeah. of it. But really, really, because I know there's a I lot, lot yeah, more. Road. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. So definitely, blessings. Heart of love. One love to you. Always, all the best to you, and um, and and your family, all the kids, all all the success in the world to them, and all the best in your coaching journey, um, as you continue to give back to the sport in this way. You understand me? Really, really appreciate you coming on, and definitely we will talk. You understand yeah, me? Man. All right. Thank you very much. I love you, too, man. Yeah, man. Love, love you, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. All right, so there you go, people. That's Craig and uh, Jingo Love Lord. We're not even calling him War Lord anymore. We're calling him the Love Lord. You understand me? Heart of love. You know, really, really, really awesome, awesome um, story. Listen, I want you to enjoy the rest of your day. And when you hear these these things, take take the, 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 the transferable principles and apply them. You, for you youngster listening, you can make it, but you need to do what you need to do. And, th and don't leave that up to the coach or up to the system. Don't wait on the JFF. Don't wait on your, league, your club. Don't wait on your school to get you into the best physical condition. Do that on your own. As Rajik Sharp has said, your fitness is your responsibility. Garfield Robinson says, determination and dedication are the main attributes of Jingo General. Let those be attributes in your own development. Again, thank you so, so much. Really appre appreciate all of you for sticking and staying. See, I mean, sometimes we don't get a super chat, we don't get a super sticker, but we appreciate the support. We appreciate the, the people watching. And all I ask is that you hit the like button, share the content, and then if you can encourage one other person to subscribe, that helps. Just say, listen, this is a good program. Listen to the interviews and subscribe to the platform. Enjoy the rest of your day. As usual, at 2.30, we have coming up our JPL show. Um, we'll have the Arnett Gardens coach, the Dumbe Holden manager. We'll have um, representative from Mount Pleasant, from Cavaliers on the program, and we'll have... Uh, Miss Isaac from the, the JPL talking about the ticketing stuff. So it's going to be a great, great show um, at 2.30 today. So stay tuned and be ready for that at 2.30 so you can hear, see some highlights and clips from the JPL games of last week and hear. Um, and you get a chance to pick your winners as well. Have a good day. I'm Manning's man. And it was good being here with you for this program. <laughs>